Hello, I'm April Slocum, and today I'm going to show you how to import a video into Adobe Photoshop for rotoscoping. First you choose File, then New, and a dialog box pops up. The size is PAL D1 slash DV widescreen square pixel. Next you give uh, the project a name and choose OK. Now the film and video file is in uh, the workspace. To see the video timeline, click on Create Video Timeline. To import the video, choose File and then Open. Choose the video you want. And click on Open. The video is now opening. The video is now in another tab. To add the video to the workspace, click on the video tab and drag the tab. Select the video and drag it onto the workspace. To resize the video, go to Edit, Transform and Scale. When this box comes up, choose Convert. You can now move uh, and resize the video to fit into uh, the safe area. I just realised I need to move the slider on the timeline to see the video. I'll just apply uh, the transformation for now. To expand the timeline, go to the mouse slider at the bottom and you will see each individual frame on the timeline. And now I can see the video in the workspace. I'm going to move it and resize it again so it fits inside the safe area. Click the select tool and this box comes up. Click on place. To create a new video layer for tracing over the video, go to layer, video layers, and choose new blank video layer. The new video layer is now on the timeline. I'm dragging the slider to ensure the video is playing. And there you have it, how to import a video into Photoshop for rotoscoping. I hope you enjoyed watching this tutorial as much as I enjoyed making it. I hope you found it useful and please give it a like if it helps you. In the next video I will show you how to do rotoscoping in this program. Thank you for watching, bye!